Well, we made it across the street. My feet hurt, Shanae. I don't know about you. Oh, all right, they're okay. okay. Well, all right, we're good. We are here in Crypto.com Arena. <laughs> I know that it is decked out in the purple and gold, but let's start talking about the Clippers a little bit because as we were walking over here and we were chatting, you said that there's a team that this Clippers squad reminds you of, Rich. Well, they remind me a lot of the 2020 Lakers, right? They have two star players at the top of their game. Mm -hmm. Obviously, Kawhi Leonard is coming back from injury, but we know what Paul George can do. And then when you look at the rest of their team, they have a bunch of gritty players. They got shooters, they got defenders, they got speed, they got depth on the bench, they got scoring off the bench. And that's really what the Lakers were. The Lakers were two star players, and then they had a bunch of solid pieces around them. That Clipper team reminds me a lot of them. Interesting. Doc? Well, the Clippers are, are my pick to make the final, so obviously I, I like the team a lot. <laughs> but if you look back at those big two teams that Richard is talking about, including that Lakers team, the big two is usually like the second and seventh best player in the NBA, something like mm -hmm. that. So the bet is, is Kawhi still that good? Is PG, can he get back to that level? Or is their depth such a perfect fit around those two guys? So much shooting, so much wing defense that ultimately they, they can slide a little bit lower and still win the whole thing. Well, so to, to me, when I'm looking at this game tonight, this is a chance to get a look at Kawhi Leonard. Not preseason Kawhi Leonard today. Kawhi Leonard that we've been waiting for to come back. What are you expecting out of him? I mean, I think it would be great if we got the man of steel because we got the quads of steel, right? But we know it might be a slow evolution. Yes, I'm very corny and punny. Um, but it's we know it might be a slow, you know, getting back to the season mm. for him. But nonetheless, this is a guy that is a two-time NBA champion, a two-time finals MVP. He's someone that, the same way we watched John Morant captivate people defensively mm. and offensively, we saw that in overtime yesterday. He's someone that can make those same types of plays. And what I love is that it's not like it's pressed. It's not like it's forced. You can make sure you still play team basketball when Kawhi Leonard is leading your team. So I agree with you. They should come out of the West, especially if they stay healthy. Oh, what's the face? There's no, they're the, the Warriors. Should is, yeah, you the, the, should is too strong for yeah, the me. Oh, Warriors, they the Warriors. Oh, 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 that is, that is, give me a little humble pie. You're right, the Warriors over the favorite. field the other Yeah, if you're yeah. saying the yeah. Warriors are going to win the okay, championship, let me that's Warriors. Can I qualify? They no, should no. come out of the West if they put themselves in the right should position. Should if all they should. Of the extra. Well, and that all comes back to Kawhi, right? I mean, exactly. the last time we saw Kawhi, remember that Dallas series where it looked like the world was caving in on the Clippers again, and right. he single-handedly on both ends of the floor won that series for them. That's the guy that they're going to need if they're going to do what Shanae and I think they're going to do. If they, if the, he's just a really good player and Dubs. not a top five player, Dubs. they can't do it. <laughs> Warriors. I just, Warriors. I, this, this, this arena might as well be like painted in Warriors colors at well, this point. Yellow, wow. yellow part is, is well this Warriors. is gold this oh, is not sorry, yellow it's gold. Well, don't, don't say that in LA. all right we, we're, we're in crypto.com you got a ball in your hands i feel like we, we can't should we bless this place we, you should bless on, this Richard. place yeah yeah i will 100 percent thumbs thumbs Orange yeah 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 no shows give me that baby oh, oh first one oh, 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 that's how we do it Wait, do it for the Clippers side of things. Let's send it over to One Kendrick take. Perkins, Thank who you. I believe has a special guest with him to talk about the oh Lakers boy. side. What's going on, Perk? Oh I see you, Shanae, shooting the three with the green <laughs> with the green heels on. But listen, we got half man, half amazing. I very obvious yeah. Carter. I'm tired of talking about the Lakers. VC, I need to hear. Is it over? Is it over for the Lakers already? Now, no, uh, perk, perk, perk. Man, uh, you know, watching the game, uh, it, it can be over, Perk, if uh, they continue to keep the team as constructed. But uh, they can fix the problem by doing a few little things, like making the trade. And what trade do they need to make? Find some shooting. Mm, for example, maybe a Buddy Hill, Miles Turner type. And the reason I say those two guys is for this reason. You get shooting, spread the floor. Miles Turner plays the five position, now puts Anthony Davis at his natural position, which he really wants to play, the four. Also, you spread the floor for transition. We heard Coach Ham talk about defensively, they need to get stops to get out in transition, where they can get to running and they can mm -hmm. get stops with those two guys because Miles Turner ability to block shots, obviously Buddy Hill ability to run the floor, and you have to account for him. Now LeBron can play one-on-one. -on -one. Now AD can play one-on-one, -on -one and he could be that top five guy like you've been saying he can and will be uh, this year. So I think little things like that will help them. I'm not saying that this will propel them to put them into the playoffs, meaning making a deep run, but this will guarantee that mm -hmm. they can get into the playoffs because now you have not just one shooter, you have two shooters that makes things a little easier for their superstars to operate. You know what, Vince, I agree with you. And there's so much uncertainty 
The question is, when is Rob Palenka going to pull the trigger and actually make something happen to acquire that shooting so that he won't be doing a disservice to LeBron James and Anthony Davis? And here it is. Thank you for watching ESPN on YouTube. For live streaming sports and premium content, subscribe to ESPN+. Plus.